Welcome back to American Latino TV. I'm Natasha Martinez. Meet Los Henrys, a blended Mexican-American family from Texas. They are at the center of the hit YouTube Red reality show, Hanging with Los Henrys. The show follows millionaire couple Tom and Azteca Henry, their two children, and the abuelita, of course, all of whom live together in a luxurious San Antonio mansion and get caught up in things like multi-million dollar quinceañeras. Up next, we hang out with Los Henrys to talk about what actually makes them a quintessential Latino family, despite any reality show preconceived notions. Check it out. Hi, I'm Thomas Henry, along with my wife Azteca, my daughter Maya. We're hanging with Los Henrys. Welcome to Hanging with Los Henrys. Azteca. Her mother, Abuelita, Teresa Mata Crawford, is from Guanajuato, Mexico. And she came to this country in the 70s and had her children, Azteca being the oldest. And we met and we have two children. So when someone asks me, you know, you're not Mexican American, my life and the people I love are Mexican American. I feel like I'm part of their family. I know I'm part of their family. And I think that uh, their culture, their heritage, and everything that's beautiful about uh, their background is part of me now. It's gonna be super elegant, like no one's ever seen before. We're short on time, but thankfully things are coming together. We've got the cake. Okay. And the model's gonna go in here. We were hesitant to do the reality show just because we kind of wanted it like the way we our vision, um, and so we finally were just like, let's do it. It's the $6 million teenage birthday party. You heard right, Maya Henry celebrated turning 15 with an extravagant bash. Well, you know, Maya's party was very expensive. We've seen that um, in the media, and of course it was a multi-million dollar event. And the reason I did it with Azteca and with Abuelita is because, you know, being Mexican-American, uh, Maya uh, deserved a quinceanera, and more importantly, uh, Abuelita, who came from Mexico and always dreamed of having a great quinceanera, wanted to see that through her granddaughter. And doing the quinceanera was just uh, a really special time for just father-daughter time, and an event that when she's 90 years old, she'll be remembering that night my dad danced with me at the quinceanera. We've been in the press for our lavish parties and people just saw that part of us when in reality we are a normal family. Happy Thanksgiving. Thank you. Hi, happy Thanksgiving. And of course I'll have folks that will say now, well you don't know what it's like to not eat. You don't know what it's like to not be able to pay a bill. And of course, I know what that's like. I know what it's like to not eat. I know what it's like to be very hungry. And so when I know that I've been fortunate enough to uh, be at this point in my life, when I see other people that have issues, uh, I am not going to judge other people. And when they've had very, very hard times, um, I really enjoy helping them through those hard times. And um, the big reward I get are the hugs, um, you know, Azteca has accused me of cheating on her during the turkey <laughs> giveaway because <laughs> I usually have red lipstick all over me. But, you know, there is uh, nothing more warm than someone giving you a big hug. And, you know, you can feel that love when you care about someone that way that is a stranger to you. I think it's good to let people see the real us, not just what the media throws out there. We're just blowing money on parties, because that's not really what we're about. <laughs> <laughs>